everybody, Dawn here, aka Miss Ellabella. So I am back with another another video of my reborn in crochet. So this is Angelina, and I'm still on a crochet roll, guys. I just and you know what? My yarn is getting low, so <laughs> I guess I'm gonna have to get some more yarn at some point. But um, as long as I have yarn, I'm gonna keep on crocheting. But anyway. Here is Angelina. She is the Angelina sculpt by Cindy Musgrove. She's an 18 inch baby, a uh, limited edition sculpt. Um, I really love her. Now I made this, I was trying to be a little whimsical when I made this hat. And I must say, I do love it. I mean, her, her head is kind of tiny, but something about this hat is so artistic and whimsical and fantasy-like. It's like a pixie hat with all these ruffles and things going around for trim and Hey, I'm out there with this crochet sometimes, and I must say that I love it. Now, I know you did not think that I stopped with that hat. No, I did not. Although the rest of the outfit is not as whimsical, it is really cute. Let me come in a little bit close so you can see. This is a crochet jumpsuit that she has on with, well, they're like overall shorts-like type of outfit. With... Some crochet sneakers. Oh my goodness gracious, she is so cute. And this outfit, I mean, she was in her other outfit for, for like months. And I mean, that's how it is in my nursery sometimes. Sometimes my babies are in outfits for so long that I think it's cute until I get another outfit that I think is really cute for them. But anyway, I wanted to come on and show you guys. I hope you guys can really see the colors are red and white with a multicolor trim for the hat. And then you have the multicolor at the top which, uh, and then the shorts attached are, you know, as you can see, are white and red with the trim. I am loving this outfit. I am so in love with making outfits for the babies. And with this, with this hat, I think it's adorable on her. I don't know when, you know, the weather is going to warm up. So I don't even know how long she's going to be in this hat. But since she is a baby doll, um, I might, she might be in it for a while because, you know, even though the weather changes, I never really took hats off my babies until it was absolutely, absolutely, really, really warm out. But anyway, I have to go. I don't want to hold you guys up. Oh, yeah, one more thing. Spring is coming, and since I've been inspired and feeling so creative, I thought the doll museum needed a change. I was talking to my husband, and I'm thinking, like, we need some paint. I need to brighten up the colors because where my doll museum is at now, it's a part of the house, but the colors are not springy and baby like there's a lot of browns and creams and i'm really not into that for my nursery i want something bright i want some flowers or some pictures or something that represents a nursery so that is my goal hopefully i can get it done i mean at the end of the day guys i always say i'm gonna paint at night when the kids are sleeping and then what happens of course you guessed it i fall asleep and then i wake up in the morning and it's time to get the kids ready for school. I mean, I get tired. I'm like, I'm just going to wait till tomorrow. But this has been going on for so long. So I really need to really get on the ball and just stay up and do it. Because obviously, if I'm painting during the day, my children are around and they will get into the paint. Especially my one-year-old who's very swift. And my four-year-old who gets into everything. My two girls, they get into everything. My little boys can be entertained with a movie or a game, but my daughters will hang around me and want to be a part of this whole project. So that is my, that is my task. Anyway, my task and my challenge when it comes to those two uh, busy bodies. Anyway, I have to go, but I, I just wanted to show you guys, Angelina, I must say I love this baby so much. I mean, they, I see the face of my nursery changing and I'm starting to get scopes that I really, really love. Even though I have my older ones, but she's one that I really, really wanted just like Azriel. And even though her painting did not come out the way I wanted, just because I love the sculpt. It's like, that's why I love this baby. But anyway, I will talk to you guys later um uh i don't want to start ranting so let me go now um yeah i think that's it anyway stay tuned more crochet will be coming until i just run out of yarn i think for now but anyway bye